Hey everyone, welcome to my channel Initial Solution. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to sort data in Excel. So let's get into the video. At first, open an Excel sheet. And here you can see there is some data which is not sorted, obviously. So what we do is click on the, you know, one of the table, one of the columns, and go to this editing, uh, editing bar and click on the sort and filter option. And here you can see there is an option of sort A to Z. If you click on it, then you can um, just click on the okay let's just first select this whole table and then go to sort to a to z and here you can see this um this table is sorted to after uh sorted after the name and the first names are the uh, you know in alphabetical orders so this is the first one so what will it do if we just what if we want to give it to sort z to a if we do the same with it then again click on it and then go to it and sort z to a and it will do the same with the um with the data you know well so now what will it do with the uh, numerical numbers let's say we want to sort by units then uh, just click on it and again go to this uh, here you can say see the thing has been changed now it says sort smallest to largest and sort largest to smallest. If we click smallest to largest, here you can see um, the expand is created with it. You can do it with the full table actually. If you do it with the full table, it will it will do it with it sort largest to smallest or sort smallest to largest so this is how it works so what will it do if we um you know customize want to customize it then you have to go to this custom sort option click on it uh, okay we have to select a single uh, cell and then go to this custom sort option and here you can see there is an option have appear has appeared which says sort by if you want to sort by units if you want to sort by units then we can do it or if we sort oh, sorry uh there should be a name option i should have highlighted it then it couldn't be okay just highlight from here well now just again from sort a to z okay now it's okay now if we want to uh, sort by custom now we have to just go to custom sort and now uh, you can see it says if i want to sort by name i can do it i can sort by name by units by values whatever i want to and if i say i want to sort by name okay and sort on 
values, cell color, font color, or cell icon. If I say I want to uh, buy values and then order Z2A, or here I can uh, create a custom list. So I'm giving it to Z2A. And then I can add some label here. Then by first I can sort by name. Then I can do by values with the cell icon. No cell icon on top. Or font color automatic. Here you can see all or the things are selected. Just click on OK. You can see the data is sorted again. So okay. Now I hope you have understood uh, till uh, till this uh, point. But what would, would you do if you want to, you know, uh, here you can, uh, here you want to keep some data and it's not, uh, you don't want to change or sort the data with the table, you know, with this table. Then uh, what you have to do is just, you have to keep um, keep a uh, keep a gap to uh, you know beside your column or arrow, and then you can keep your data by here, uh, in here, in here, in here, or in here, in here, or whatever you want to. Just keep uh, one or two you know columns and rows distance from your original data okay let's give me uh, let's give you let me give a an example if i want to uh, okay. just randomly i'm just you know writing something but just click on it and sort again from A to Z. You can see the data is sorted according to it, and it will be same with the with this, you know, with this column also, with this uh, rows also. You can see. Okay, now just click on sort to filter here. You can see it's just sorted like here. So just. Let's undo it first. Okay, what we have to do is just simply keep our data here. <coughs> Sorry, keep our data here. Okay, here if you want to give here and sort it, and if I write some data, some numerical data here. Um, just randomly I'm putting some numbers here you can see if I just uh, you know if I click on them it won't be changed don't be changed won't be changed at all well if you simply um you know click on the you know select this whole thing then it will be sorted but if you don't do it then it won't be sorted it will keep your data um protected from the sorting option so this is how you can um sort your data in excel Hope this tutorial helps you. If it does, then please like, comment, and share this video. Subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get more useful videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye for today.